another quick video. Now, I've shown you that um, the name Domino has come up in at least three Seattle false flag related predictive programming pre-advertising movies. Thunderball, Bond, um, Never Say Never Again Bond. Uh, the leading characters are called Domino and of course the film itself Domino by Tony Scott lead character of course Domino the space needle being blown up at the end of that film and in the Bond movies where the um, Domino characters are played by women as well then there's two nukes in each film and there's submarines in each film okay now here's a fourth one I've already shown it to you uh, I just didn't look into it at the time but uh, yeah this girl Zazie Beats is playing Domino again now this all relates to the Seattle false flag and I think that is the beginning of the dominoes effect the actual start of the tipping over of, of the combined disasters everything the fall of America in the fall I've shown you all the uh, the predictive programming for that the fall this fall series this fall movies um, this fall in all the predictive programming for Seattle it's it's and the fall of course if you're not American is autumn that's now so you got your eye of Lucifer as usual Deadpool 2 Zazie beats throwing it the older uh, eye of Ra here eye of Lucifer one eye right now I had a quick look at Zazie beats again as you can see Eye of Ra, Lucifer. Um, father. Now you can see from the uh, from the eyes that she's not all black at all and very light skinned. Her mother was American, Afro American apparently, as far as we're told. Well, I can believe that, but the father is German. Yes, of course, German, Jewish, Yiddish. Of course, as it all goes back to Germany, it all does. That's the power structure right there. There's your Freemasonry. German Jewish father. Just like Zoe Saldana and Yafet Koto. Half Jewish. This is how you get into the um, Zionist media. It's the only way. You have to have Jewish parentage in one, at least half. Um, now, here's another classic thing. She's starring in Deadpool 2. She's 26 years old. I give her one more year, and then it's sayonara, okay? She's a half-blood princess, not good enough. Give her one more year, 27, 27 club, good night. Here she is standing on the checkerboard floor, and I want to show you this. See this picture here? You see... It's three black people, some kind of Atlanta series or film or whatever, yeah? And they've got, I think they've got peaches. I don't think these are apples. These are peaches stuffed in their mouths. Keeping them quiet, stuffing them up, taking the pee out of them. She's standing on her checkerboard floor. She knows what she's in, but... Yeah, does she really know about the 27 Club? This 26-year-old girl. So, yeah, there's another picture with her with a checkerboard scarf somewhere around here as well. Um, yeah... It's not looking good all round. Deadpool. Uh, yeah, the first Deadpool movie, I mean, of course, I haven't seen it because it's all um, gay agenda. I'm not interested in, in watching a movie with that. Um, but yeah, I mean, she's in the second one. She's playing Domino. <sighs> yeah, it's, it's really, really not looking good. Gay agenda was heavy on the first one. I mean, I'll, I'll show you um, as well. Let's see if we can find the image. Uh, one second. Yeah, it's that one. You see what I'm saying? Gay agenda all over it. Pink. This. This. Yeah. Freemasonry, gay mafia. So, yeah, they're serving up another Zoe Saldana type, right? Half Jewish. 
And the black community will go, oh, we've got a new star. No, you haven't. No, you haven't. I was going to make a video about it as well. It's just like all these um, black girl uh, rap stars and movie stars. You'll find that the majority of them are transgender. I, I can I can prove that. They are. The majority are. So the only people that get, only black people that get let into the Zionist media are transgender, half Jewish, boule masons who really sell themselves out to to their Yiddish masters. Um, that's it. You know? Scumbags like Samuel L. Jackson. Satan, Satan, son of Satan, of course. Yeah. Everything stinks at the moment. You, you, you can all feel it. And um, like I say, the, the domino effect here, that's, that's, I reckon that is Seattle. And I reckon it's very soon. It has to be in the fall. Yeah. I think it has to have a three in the date, 13, 31st, one of those coming up soon. And um, everything will go off from there. You're talking about blackouts, madness. In America, it'll be just as much an attack on America, or even more of an attack on America, than on North Korea. You know, Israel literally telling their their puppets, America, to attack themselves and bring themselves down. And for the sake of money, these Freemasons in America will do it. They'll take their own country down. I wouldn't want to be in America right now. No way. <laughs>